Hello YouTube, Sacafee and Aconite here, and uh, this video is another right quick DIY video. Not a painting, but uh, something... I don't think it's anything I've done before. I mentioned in uh, Goth for Guys episode 3 or 4 was it? Uh, how to do home decor in some way or another, mostly DIY stuff. And um, just recently I came up with the idea from seeing a video of Ligia Resurrected, Adrian on YouTube. Uh, and I couldn't help but notice behind her there's like this, uh, this bottle with black roses in it. Uh, insert photo here. And um, I got the bright idea with one of these here kombucha bottles. Um, I don't drink the stuff, I just happened to find it from a friend. Uh, to turn it into something a little similar, um, mostly inspired by, uh, admittedly, uh, someone else's work, though. I think it was Voltaire who showed a candelabra that he made out of, you know, wax and the bottles and everything. I'm wishing I would have done a label on it or some at some point all the way around like this, but, you know, it turned out the way that it did, so, um, here's some photos. So, I'm liking the way this turned out. I covered it, um, the hot glue with some silver nail polish. Because, you know, I'm just going for a werewolf theme lately and this just felt right. I couldn't find anything else, uh, like acrylic paint or whatever, uh, to use as an ideal enamel. So, that's why I used this. It works for my canes either way, so what else was I going to use, right? I have leftover plain red plastic roses uh, from when I modified my hat. Uh, they're not black, but I think they'll work regardless. Um, just, you know, as a nice little display piece for like the middle of a table or whatever. Um, I just remembered. There was this, um, I used to be pissed as shit that this channel used to exist. Uh, and probably still does, uh, back when I was, uh, new to the goth subculture, but there was this, uh, this channel called Goths Doing Things, I believe it's now called The Goth Next Door, um, my face just fell, um, and they used to do these videos, uh, playing as goths, posing, and, um, They'd go out to some place like, uh, I don't know, like a fast food restaurant, or they'd be uh, at the laundromat, and just to liven their lack thereof mood, I guess, uh, what, they'd, what they'd do is they'd either bring an animal skull or some kind of candles or, you know, a display piece like a stick or whatever. Uh, I, I could just see them doing that with, you know, what I just made is uh, what's so funny about that, but I'm really pleased that it turned out the way that it did. I'd, I'd love to make something else like it in the future. Working with hot glue just feels right. It feels, it, it's quick, but that's what's so great about it. It's convenient. The material's are just there. And you get to, you know, there's people who use it like a 3D printer. They sculpt with the stuff. So, um, I don't know if you'll be seeing that in the future, but, uh, that's how I make my shrunken heads, too. So, maybe you you might be in for a treat there. If you like, please like. Feel free to share your obscure little thoughts in the comments below, as well as to share the video itself. Subscribe if you wish to see more. Don't forget to hit the bell if you do. And as always, thank you so very much for watching, and I love you all.